And the Pacers for the third time this year. They'll start the road trip with the Bulls. Double team comes. Here's the difference. The difference is simply when he got the double team, he stepped away from the basket to draw the double team closer to him, which means it's easier to find somebody open. So Victor had a chance to measure that shot and knocked it down. Now they have the ball and a chance for their first lead of the night. Well, the depot blows by the defender, and the Pacers are in front. A different energy, different intensity. Victor Oladipo and Indiana have forced the Chicago Bulls to call the first timeout of the quarter. Oladipo had missed his six consecutive threes, and now he goes to the rim on the steal, and he has scored seven of his 18 all in a row. And now he's going to shoot a three over Carter, and that is another basket, and that's 10 straight for Oladipo. Oladipo's come out and said, hey, we got to win this game. 70-69, Oladipo gets around Carter and lays it in. Well, he's been able to get where he needs to get around Carter. There's no way Carter can really guard him out there. I'm not sure Carter's ever seen anybody with that quickness and size. He splits oh, he the defense. Him. He beat him. Yeah! it down! Well, he got that crossover and he beat him and from there they were struggling Chris They are in trouble once he splits two against one quick to Domas Those two have been bringing his... What a show! Don has made two threes Levine That's all right You take a timeout and no foul it. And it's a 104-102 Pacers lead Listen, Victor is right there He's got his hand up I'm not sure what else you can do Levine, a three. Oh, he doesn't have a timeout. We got to push it. Oladipo with three seconds, with two seconds. Ah, he mishandled it. They doubled up at him, and he mishandled the ball. Levine hadn't made anything, Chris. And then he knocks down. Uh, hey, the guy made a heck of a shot. That's what this league is about. This is about make some misses, and he makes a three. The Chicago Bulls. Hit four threes down the stretch. Oladipo, a three. Oh, yeah, Vic. Overmarketing right in his face. Victor Oladipo with ice in his veins. He has 33. And now finds Turner to give the Pacers the lead. Oh, Miles Turner. That's a nice trade there. His second Ooh. three. Look at this defense. They're, they're still at the three-point line. He made, Chris, that's just a heck of a three. That's all right. He makes a heck of a three. Lowry Markinen with Collison in his face. And now with five seconds, here's Oladipo, three seconds. Let's race up. A three race to up. win it. Leaks yeah. it in. Yeah. Way to race up on the Vic. Victor Oladipo. <laughs> Way to race up. <laughs> Banks in a three-point shot. And with point three left, the Pacers lead by three. Victor Oladipo has matched his season high of 36 with a huge overtime three. Uh, they send Miles away because they don't want the double team, which is good because Nate McMillan did that. And right here, Vic just backs him up, shoots it a little long, dead, dead on, and it goes down. Now, there may be more than three-tenths of a second, but at that point, who cares? Vic can knock down a three. And Levine. No. That's... Anna, did they call a foul? I'm thinking they're calling the basket good. They're saying it was late. Okay, it was late. It was just late. They didn't count it out of bounds. They said it's just late. Pacers won. Pacers won. That's a heck of a win. 119-116 as the shot did not get off in time, though Levine made another one.